guys welcome back to my channel in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to make an easy oven steamed fish so for this you're going to be needing some foil and I have three beautiful red snappers that I already cleaned I do have a video up in this channel showing you guys how I clean the fish after I clean it I let it sit in some salt water overnight just to get some extra flavor in my fish and I have one lemon and I have one onion and I have some habanero pepper this is one habanero and a red bell pepper and I have some thyme and I have about a teaspoon and a half of pimento seeds and I have three tablespoon of vinegar three tablespoon of olive oil and three tablespoon of freshly squeezed lime juice and two tablespoon of my Haitian spice which I do have a video up on this channel showing you guys how I make the spice I'll leave the link for that down in the description box for you guys and I'll be using about a teaspoon and a half of minced garlic and of course some salt and pepper to taste please check the description box where I will list everything I use in this video for you guys so let's get cooking guys okay you're going to start by turning your stove on to medium high and I'm gonna go ahead and add my olive oil and to that I want to add my garlic about a teaspoon and a half and let it cook a little bit so let it cook for about 30 seconds to a minute okay so to that I'm gonna go ahead and add my hot peppers like I said this is really really hot you guys if you don't like heat don't add that and I'm gonna go ahead and add my pimento seed the third end and I forgot to mention I am going to be adding about four dry bay leaves and then add my thyme and just saute it for about a minute as well and now I'm gonna go ahead and add my lime juice and add my vinegar and stir and also add some salt the amount of salt you add is totally up to you and some black pepper and I'm going to let this simmer for about five to six minutes okay guys now it's time for the fun part you want to go ahead and preheat your oven to 400 degrees and now you want to go ahead and grab your fish and take some of that Haitian seasoning or a piece put in the on the inside of the fish and just rub it in really really nice I'm not going to put any on the outside of the fish I'm going to use that gravy that we just made to put on the outside and then I'm going to take some of that gravy put right on the inside and take just a little bit of salt and sprinkle on the inside of your fish and now you want to take some onions and lemon put as much on the inside as you possibly can and then now for the outside of the fish I'm gonna go ahead and flip it over and add some of that gravy that we just made and flip it over again just so we can get both sides and add more on top take your peppers and a little bit more onions I like my spicy so I'm gonna go ahead and add one of that hot pepper on top of mine 
just like this and add a little more salt not too much be easy on the salt and some black pepper and now you want to take another foil place it on top because you want to give it a lot of room so you don't want to make it too tight and just fold them just like this this is going to be so nice to make on the Easter time just make sure you fold it really good so nothing leaks out of it just like this and now this is ready to go in the oven 400 degrees for about 40 minutes um, if you haven't please go like my Facebook page please share that page and come follow me on Instagram and come snap with me on Snapchat and follow my Twitter page as well. I will leave the link for those down in the description box below for you guys to check out. So now this is ready to go in the oven for 40 minutes. I'm going to place it on top of a cookie sheet just so my oven doesn't get messy. My fish are done steaming. They were steaming for 40 minutes. Now it's time to check and see what's happening in there. Look at this, guys. This is just so beautiful. I wanna taste a tiny bit. I don't wanna mess up my presentation for when I take my pictures. Mm. It's spicy, but not extremely spicy. And the flavor and the salt, everything tastes so amazing. And this will do it for this video, guys. Please give this video a try for Good Friday. And I do have a Escovitch video up on the channel and other fish videos. And please, guys, don't forget to subscribe this recipe with all your loved ones. And as always, please remember to subscribe to the channel, comment, like, and please be share. And again, thank you guys so much for watching and I love you guys for watching. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.